Good morning, Marvel Squad. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far. So last night has been a really hard night for Bill and I just wanna say that I give him a lot of credit for you know going through with the surgery and being as tough as he is because he literally slept on a gaming chair. His gaming chair that he sits on and edits and like does all of that, I'll throw up a clip right here. You can already see how uncomfortable, how he's not like, it's just, who wants to sleep on a chair? Like that is like, I would not want to be able to do that. That's like so uncomfortable. But today I'm basically gonna be taking care of him and just making sure he's okay. And you know, giving you guys a little bit of an update. So Bill is actually sitting right here. <laughs> I'm talking like he's not even by me. How are you doing this morning? Isn't it weird you? seeing my head like this? It is, it's kind of- Do I look like an alien Marvel Squad? It's kind of gross, I'm gonna cover it a little bit so people don't really cringe out. Or Do I look like an alien? Sorry, if, if a lot of you guys find this gross, it's really not gross, because all it is is a shaved head with little hair follicles. Yeah, it just <laughs> buzzed, like it's, it's like it's like a buzz. I don't even want to come close, guys, because it's kind of like crazy, but Bill, tell us about your night. How was your sleep? It was absolutely terrible. I woke up every single hour on the dot, and I woke up like mad every single time because I was so tired, but I couldn't get a good sleep, and my head was throbbing. Not because of this. This doesn't hurt at all. It's, it's my stitches. stitches. Which we're going to show you guys later tonight, because yes. I I actually have to clean that tonight for him. We're gonna film like him dumping water. Are you doing the water dumping tonight? I can, yeah. I think tonight he's gonna kind of clean his head. Just stay tuned because this is gonna be the first reveal of the stitches yeah at the end of the video or somewhere in between this video and you're not going on to miss it because it's actually crazy bill showed me the video well actually you guys probably saw it already on camera right yeah, but now you'll see it like actually up close but now you'll actually see it up close and i have to be the one that puts the neosporin on it and i just want to say i will do anything for bill i love him so much and i don't care if he has the biggest wart on his face and i had a pocket for him <laughs> i'm just saying Whoa. i'm yes i you I've asked her to pop a pimple for me before and she's never. Okay, well, I'm just saying, if I had to, I would. But the thing is, is I used to not really care as much, but recently, over the past couple years, I've been kind of like, if I see blood or I see stuff like that, I cringe and like, I, I feel like I'm like gonna faint. But I don't know it's why. Not even, it's not even like that. It's I not know. even red. It's just a little red. It's not even like that. It's anymore. just, I'm gonna be a little nervous putting this on him tonight. Oh, and I still can't bend over all the way, so I have to like, anything that I do, if I drop something on the ground, I have to like, do this. Yeah, and last night he said, where did you say you accidentally did? You touched the back of your head on accident? I woke up to me like touching my head. I was like, but it didn't mess anything up. Don't worry, I don't think. No, so we'll see today, when it goes out, today can you bend over at all? Like, or is it's it? It's probably more solid in there now. You might want to call, I think you should call the doctor today and make sure that you can like. They actually called me, I didn't call them back. Oh my yet. gosh, wait, we have to call them back on video then. We should call them back on video. <laughs> Let's show them really quick though what you what you had to go through oh, last Mariah night. Oh, Mariah already cleaned it up. Well, I wanted to be sweet, Okay, baby. so picture, picture this. Yesterday, we popped the clip. We already kind of showed this it. This was right here, but no, I had all of this. I've been trying to kind of clean the room up as much as I can. I had can. all of this on the ground and basically what I was doing is I went like this like because I was like this half the night but then I wanted to come over here for a foot rest and then I would take the blanket and I'd wrap my arms in it and put my arms right here. Oh, it's that kind of help you from that. But when I would sleep that ring is around here so my head's kind of like only being supported by that ring and I was kind of like last night he was he was literally procrastinating going to bed because he did not want to itch himself in the night he was so <sighs> I've never seen you more scared in your life that you were gonna I just itch. wanted to you know but now it's probably more solid in there you know like when you get a cut you could put the cut back together and it'll like grow back together yeah that's what my hair has to do that's why they said it could fall out but like I think it's let's go enough. call your doctor back let's talk to her let's see what you know, ask her all the questions that you need to ask so you don't have to keep calling her. This looks so weird it, for the Marvel Squad. It probably sure. does, and I'm so sorry, guys, that this is a little bit too much for you. But I got a hairline now. But we want to show you guys, like, the whole process. We want to be able to show right, you guys, go like, home. everything that's go that goes down during this. Let's because, you know, if you are a guy and you want to get this done, just know you can do it because he did it, and he's strong. Or girl. Or that's girl. Yeah, actually, the girl's girl at the gym, this older lady, asked was asking she Bill about it, and I was like, good for you. And now I can show her, actually. Yeah. I was like, you, 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 you could be a baddie just like him. All right, guys, he's calling for the answer. I'm trying to 
sorry I missed your call. Feel free to leave a detailed message and I will get back to you as soon as possible. I just had a, a hair transplant surgery yesterday and I just had a couple questions about the aftercare and what I can do on the second day. I know we went over it in the office, but I just have some questions about like showering and washing it and stuff. All right. So you have to wait for the phone call back. I'm kind of not showing me. the top of your head right now just so if people are a little bit cringed out. Spent all this money and I can't even get an answer. <laughs> well, they called you, you didn't answer. So honestly, what about you? I know. So Bill, tell me what you have to do. So after we were done getting surgery, they were spraying my head like the whole time they were like implanting everything. As you saw, if you watched our recent YouTube video, you can kind of see a little bit what they were doing. This is like nutrition hairspray it, with sea salt and all these like, you know, minerals and stuff. It's supposed to like make, uh, you know, your- Head moist, right? And kind of clean it. It's keep your head moist and also kind of I think like, the sea salt cleans it. Yeah, because like there's I use water that, in it and everything. I use that for my cartilage piercing here. Oh yeah, you could probably use it for your ears, but this is for like scalp. So like yeah. all you do is you just, Kind of go over it and spray it a little bit and then just let it dry. Oh, and, and there might be a little redness around oh, here. Oh, yeah. That's because, first of all, they, that's where they put all the shots, you know? But yeah, at the same swollen. time, oh. there might be stuff that's dripping and that's just like kind of all the stuff on my hair. That's why we're the hoping. The B-L-O-O-D that also is kind of getting washed off. But none of this is like bleeding at That's all. why we're okay, hoping we're right. able to kind of clean it tonight so it doesn't look as red and gory. But it feels good. Like, I'm not going to lie. It doesn't Oh. Hurt. The stitching hurts but I took three ibuprofen today. I feel good. And, I, and it, it feels way better, yeah. So, That's probably why I went back to I that. don't know if we told you guys, but Bill's head, like I feel like in the next video, it's gonna be swollen. So I'm really, I, I, I wanna film it for you guys because I feel like it's gonna be so like crazy because it is like a- Oh yeah, after the fourth day, they yeah, say Saturday. my head is gonna swell up because they have medicine in my head right now that only lasts like three to four days that keeps the swelling down. So my head's gonna get huge in like Like days. how big did they say? Like just gonna start bubbling up. <gasps> and Guys, stay tuned for that because we're gonna document gonna it all. Crazy. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Hopefully it's not as bad as it as it as it sounds. Hopefully it's no, just minor, but but sleeping is the worst thing in the world. So we did decide he is going show him how you're gonna sleep tonight. We are gonna have to try to figure out how to block this off. Sleeping is the absolute worst for thing the in the cats. world if you do the surgery. It's worse than getting Stung by the anesthesia or whatever oh. they were using on my head to numb it. It's it, oh that sleeping is worse Sleeping is worse because first of all I can't even get any sleep you wake up all peed off and your head kind of feels uncomfortable So you can't even really focus on so sleeping. we figure out a better comfortable situation for him We didn't really think about this last night. And but they gave me this too. So yeah, they gave him that so kinda he's just, just gonna do this But we just have to keep the cats from coming up like this is comfy Okay, you guys, I'm kind of blocking his head just so if you guys, just since it's more close up, you guys aren't getting a little <laughs> out. But yeah, this is gonna be a sleeping. We're gonna have to figure out how to block it off because the cats are gonna like to play, huh, Snap? Snap! You like to play? Yeah, and we don't want you messing up daddy's, daddy's hair. We don't want you licking his head and playing <laughs> and accidentally hitting anything. Okay? Right. You go back to sleep, but you got you when he's out here, you gotta be good boy. Also, I wanna give you guys a little perspective of my night. So if you are somebody that, you know, is or their boyfriend or your your girlfriend does go through this, just know I last night was tossing and turning because all night I was like worried about him. I wanted to make sure like he was sleeping good. I wanted to make sure he was taking his medicine on time. Even though he was giving me a hard time, I tried to wake him up at like five in the morning and I was like, babe, I'm like, you need to take your medicine, and he was like mm. and I'm like babe trust me you are gonna want to stay up on your medicine you're not gonna want to wait until the pain comes back you want to stay on it so that the pain I didn't take it last night you didn't no. <gasps> you went to, I just fell asleep no wonder why you are in pain this morning <laughs> baby you have to stay consistent that's why I woke you up at five in the morning and then I woke him up and he starts to go like this he starts to go like this and I'm like babe no and he looks at me he looks at me like this do you remember looking at me like this you're like what <laughs> I think I've been a pretty good girlfriend during this. I've been really trying to help him. I've been cleaning. I, I brought the blanket out for you. I've been trying to make you comfortable. I kept asking all night if he was okay. Like, I love him so much and I just want to help him because he's, I feel like I've never seen you in pain like this. Yeah. I've never seen you do something this crazy and I just want to be here throughout the whole way. And I love you so much and I'm love so you. proud of you. You know how proud I am of you? Yeah. And how much I love you. Love you too. And I'm gonna be here for you through this whole journey and I'm gonna love you and <laughs> I can't wait to freaking kiss you. Well, I could kiss you, but yeah. I just can't wait to like yeah, cuddle you again and see your confidence grow. Me too. <laughs>
<laughs> All right, baby. So I don't know if you can see right there, but I surprised you with breakfast because I, I really I want that. and I really want to take care of you. The reason, guys, I didn't get to surprise him that I wanted to was Bill touched his head and my stitches are bleeding, and I don't know if they're supposed to. I feel like stitches bleed, right? I don't know. I feel like stitch, my stitches. I went like that, and they were bleeding. So I don't know, and it sucks because I guess the lady called him back, and he wasn't. So, oh. I feel like it shouldn't be bleeding that much. Maybe it's from me moving this around a little bit. Maybe it's irritating. I haven't touched it in a while. I just, it started feeling weird and all of a sudden. I don't know. Let's not freak, us, freak ourselves out just quite yet. But yeah. I got a good breakfast. We got a good breakfast. I, I don't know what I got, you. but I, it looks good. You'll see. I want to surprise <laughs> you and I'm taking care of you today. This is all about you and Maybe I. Maybe I should just stop moving as much because it's making my blood probably move faster. Probably. I should just take it easy and not lay, more lay upright. Did you still want to film my TikTok or? Yeah, yeah. I'll be fine. You're fine? Yeah, it's just my stitches are bleeding now, so. Oh, she's Hopefully. calling. Oh. Hello? Hi, it's Casey. From hey. Treats, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Uh, did someone follow up with you regarding uh, the message you left with the answering service? No. Okay, so what prescription were you needing? Um, so actually I figured out the prescription. I just wasn't sure what time I should start taking it But I just started taking like the antibiotics last night and um, six hours from whenever they gave me the ibuprofen I started taking um, I took one tablet of the uh, Prescribed um, pill just because the pain was like kind of a little worse um, But so I figured all that out, but I do have a question regarding my stitches sure. now Okay. So, um, I just like, my, my head started feeling weird and I just like, kind of like a little tingly probably because the, the, you know, medicine or whatever is okay. wearing off. And yeah, or the nerves. And I touched like kind of where it felt like that and it was like bleeding a little bit. Is it bad for the stitches to be bleeding a little? No, there can be bleeding and oozing, but it should stop. Today. Okay. Is, is it still bleeding and oozing or was it just like a little bit? I can't fully see because they put gauze around my whole stitch and they said not to take it off until the nighttime when I go to apply like a little more Neosporin. So um, you can remove that now. The bandage can come off now. Okay. And you're gonna apply Neosporin. The bleeding and oozing is common after the procedure, but it should stop today. So okay. It might also just be because of that. Cause it's like around my head really tight. So maybe it is squeezing yeah. a little bit. Yeah, so I would remove bandage, apply Neosporin. You can start the H2 Ocean Spray and you're going to spray the grafted area every two hours today and let it air dry. That can should be gone by today or tomorrow. Okay, yeah, I, that's the other thing that I wasn't sure if I should should have started it yesterday. So I did spray it once before I went to bed just because okay. like, yeah. So um, you should not spray your head if you're going to lay down. So today, when you're spraying it every two hours, if you're going to lay down and take a nap, don't spray it before you nap. Just because the area will be moist, and we don't want it to potentially touch any cloth and then the grass okay. dislodge. I did make sure that it was completely, like I, I stood under a fan until it dried last night. Okay. Because they, they said for it to like, you have to wait for it to fully dry. Yes, correct. Okay. That so. is right. But I won't do it now that I know that, but yes, okay. Yes, cleaning your head. And then. And then when it comes tonight, they said that I can like pour like room temperature water on my head and should I touch it with my fingers like they were saying? No. Okay. Not until day four. Okay, that's what I thought. On day four is when you add in a gentle shampoo. I always recommend a baby shampoo. And on that day is when you'll begin to massage gently in a circular motion over the grafted area and the suture line when you're rinsing with the gentle shampoo and water, but that's not till day four. And you need to be letting your head air dry for the next two weeks, no towel or blow dryer. Tonight, am I able to dump the water or should I wait on that too? Um, you can do it tonight or tomorrow evening, whatever is best for you. Just let it air dry though. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let it air dry. All right, I think that's, yeah, I think that's about it. I was just curious on those little details, but I appreciate you okay. calling me. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Make sure you sleep with the neck pillow until day four. Also on day four to five, swelling can peak. So if you wake up and you notice your face, your eyes are swollen, that is common. You're going to ice on your forehead or on your eyes, the back of your neck. Do not ice directly on the grafted area or the suture line. Okay. I will call you when you're one week out, but at any point, if you have any questions or concerns, you can always call me. Okay. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. Have a good day. Have a good one as well. Uh -huh. Bye. Was that your surgery, girl?
No, this is like the uh, girl that's gonna be oh keeping up with keeping you. Keeping up, yeah. Okay. Surgery girl is more. So we gotta take off after we eat. Let's take off your this and put yeah. some Neosporin on I it. I want to take this off now. I don't know. That's probably why, because it's literally this. It's like I'm gonna take a piece of tape and going as hard as you can around your head. It like squeezing my head. Well, we gotta we gotta also film that TikTok vlog of me taking off the wrapper for the first time. Oh my gosh, we have so much guys All to right, process. We're gonna go eat and then we'll be back. Yeah, we'll be back. So we are about to take off his wrapper. Don't do it yet because we're also filming a TikTok. So you guys are gonna see behind the scenes of our TikTok vlog. Right, ready? I'm um, ready to get this thing off. You want me to just film it in the? All right. All right, take it off. Oh my gosh! Does the price feel nice, huh? Oh my gosh. Ooh, how's it feeling? Oh. Oh, oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. How's that feel? That feels so, that feel? much, so much better. So much better? I'm oh my god. Squeezing gosh. all the blood in my head. Look at that fresh hairline, boys. Right, my forehead's still gonna look pretty big because like we couldn't bring the hairline down because there's a lot of muscle here, she said. But it doesn't really matter because you see like right here, the hair will cover up to like right there. I have a good ass hairline. Yeah. How about stitches look? I'm gonna do 360, already. Right? If you do not like stitches, skip this video, but we're gonna show it really quick. Um, show it. Oh. Oh I look like Frankenstein. Gosh, you look like Frankenstein. Stop. Oh! It is time to put the Neosporin on it, and I'm honestly just like kind of freaking out. Should I do it with like- She has to touch it, by the way. She should I put gloves it. on? Do you have like gloves that I can like- You don't have to wear gloves. Well, I don't my nail to like, I want to be able to like- I don't have any gloves. <laughs> we only have two things that- I'm gonna freak out, baby. I'm not trying to be panicky. All you do is rub some on your finger. Don't obviously poke me with your nail, but just go over it slow, slightly like this. They did it. I mean, they were wearing gloves. They're, they're wearing gloves? <laughs> They're professionals, babe. I know. Just put it put, put it on your finger first. Oh, I'm nervous. Come on, you got this. This is good practice for when we have kids and our kids need help. And also, it's gonna look way better too because see all this hair? All my wacky hair, when I get a haircut, my forehead's gonna look really good. So I just dab it on there? Yeah. Huh. I have a good hairline though now. Baby, I'm nervous. I don't wanna do it with my bare hand. Spread it around a little bit on your finger. All right, I'll go softly. It'll be good. Don't move, please. Does that hurt? No. Nah. You can rub, oh, slowly rub. Yeah. Slowly. And not hard, not hard. Okay, was it hard? <laughs> You're like, I didn't mean to, it. I'm sorry. Oh, guys, this is hard. This is like scary. All right, guys, I did it. I freaking did it. I've never done that before in my life. And honestly, it wasn't as bad as I thought. I think I was just more nervous because I didn't want to like hurt you and like, it's just scared. I've never actually touched <laughs> stitches before. That was like my first time. Oh, I remember touching stitches. I've never had stitches before. Really? Yeah, and it's crazy because I literally have like a whole 12 inches of stitch. It looks, I literally look like I have a new head on, guys. And what's crazy is, you know, all my hair that comes over my head that I had, you know, like my hairstyle, it's still there. They clipped everything down with bobby pins. So don't worry, my hair is all still here. Whenever this is ready that I can flip my hair over, I'll look like normal Bill again until this grows out. So how many times a day do I have to do your nail sport? Like once a day, I think. Oh, how many we'll do once. Do? We'll do once. We one more. Oh, okay. We can get more nails more. We yeah. should honestly do more. We should give out. Maybe I'll do a little bit of a shipped order and I can get. It. Yeah, we should get more just in case. We should probably do another one tonight. Okay. Um, We're gonna then... wash his hair tonight too, guys, with water. Right? Yeah. Do that tonight or do you wanna? I just can't touch it. Yeah, you just. I have to let it air dry. I would just rinse it. I think you should rinse it. I don't know. Should we show them the scar? Because I don't want to like. I don't want to mess. Like if any, if anyone on here has like a problem where they don't want to see like scars or something, it's not bad. It's just like. I can show you guys. Just skip this part. All right, we're like literally. We're only gonna show for five seconds a little scar. It's not bad at all. There's really there's no red spots. Really, you're gonna see a Frankenstein looking scar. So if you yeah. don't want to see that, just skip over. Like double tap the screen twice and it'll be done. But I'm just gonna do a little twirl for the people that wanna see it. Cause I wanna be transparent with you guys. That's why I'm even comfortable with showing you. But I do have a good hairline. You do, it's gonna look amazing once it's filled Even in. though my forehead's big, like guys, I was, no, I was looking thing. at my line, guys, like a lot of guys have big foreheads. I feel like small foreheads kinda look weird sometimes. No, honestly, 
Just seeing the hairline, once that hair grows, honestly, you're gonna look so good with hair. Even with the four, it doesn't even matter how big your forehead well, I'm is. I'm gonna do a man bun now. Yeah, oh my God, it's gonna look so cute. All and right. once I get the, sh the sides, cause the sides are all like this, once I get them either close to my head or shaved, it's gonna look Did amazing. she say that she thinks you're gonna bald in the back anymore? I don't think so, but any, I might have to get a touch up. But I, right, this is the part, ready? Okay. All right, skip this part if you don't wanna see it, ready? Oh, wow. Wow, guys, wow. Was that Absolutely crazy? insane. It's actually insane, and I didn't even see what they looked like until I rewatched the clips from last video. If you did not go see our recent video, make sure you go watch it because it's crazy. Like when I saw it, I'm like, holy crap, that's a lot of stitches. Yeah, it is. I gotta pee though. <laughs> so okay. When you okay, yeah. We don't wanna see that. No, you don't. Guys, Bill's mom just sent Bill the sweetest thing ever. Are you ready to see it? I already see it. Guys, look at the, the chocolate. Oh, Baby, not only you are gonna be eating this, I'm gonna be eating this. Look, it's got a little thinking of you balloon. Well, technically. You have the best mom ever. Technically Col she. Mama Colleen is the best. Technically she got it for me, not for you. Well, I could share it. Can I have some? <laughs> yeah, you can. Since I'm helping, yeah. I can have one or two. But I you know can have she, the most Mariah of it. loves chocolate strawberries. Guys, show Mama Colleen love in the comments. Okay. Get yourself a mom that supports you and loves you and cares for you in the ways that his mom does. Thank you, Colleen. We literally love you so much. We're Thank gonna call you, you right now and tell you it to your face. Yeah, I'm but you. sorry, my head hurts. Your head hurts? Yeah. Oh, you need to take more medicine. Yeah. Oh, baby. So we're heading to bed and we wanted to show you guys um, Bill dumping the water on his head to kind of clean all the blood. He has been bleeding a lot from his stitches. I don't know why. A lot. A lot. We're not going to show you, but like. I'm hoping by tomorrow that it's better because they said that it's not supposed to be bleeding as much. Right? Yeah, basically, they said it's supposed to stop bleeding tonight. And it didn't. It obviously is not going to anytime soon. But it's in the same spot on both sides, so I just think it's a really tension spot. Then. Maybe you're talking too much. No, I don't think talking, I don't feel my thing moving anytime I talk. Maybe yeah, when I sleep. Cold sides. Ever since I took off the gauze thing, I've been bleeding. Maybe it's getting it all out. Yeah, but now I have to dump water on my head. But. For four days, I, I can't even wash the top of my head yet. So I figured out, I think the word that's like, people that don't like seeing holes and like clumpers, ugh, clumpy and stuff. Yeah. It's called, I think it's called triphobia or something like oh, that. Oh yeah, because I've seen comments on our YouTube. On TikTok too. Oh, and TikTok. I'm, I'm like that, I'm like that, but it's you, so I love you. But we're gonna show you guys really quick and then we're gonna end today's video just because we're gonna have Bill shower. And don't worry, I'm in my underwear, so I'm not fully, you know, gone, but I need to kind of see what I'm doing though. Ooh, you kind of can see the blood. Oh really? Yeah. But you right. gotta get out. He's not scared. <laughs> Hey. Get out. Get out. Back up. Back up. Okay. All right, let's do it. You nervous? You want me to do it for you? Probably. No, 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 don't, 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 don't look down. Oh yeah. You need to kind of like, just like rinse All right, it. Here, here, here. All right, so I'm gonna kneel down and Mariah's gonna slowly pour it. Make sure not to touch my head. No. Okay, you ready? Close your eyes. Does that hurt? No, it's cold. I don't even feel it running now. Probably because it's still numb. It's still numb? Yeah. <laughs> they look cleaner. Mm. Oh, it definitely looks cleaner. Ew, you're showing them way too much. Yeah, I know. Sorry, guys. But guys, we're gonna let it air dry. He's gonna get in the shower. We're gonna head to bed. It has been a long day, at least for me. I've been like doing all like the work around the house and you know making sure and taking care of him. So I'm Which ready I for love. bed. Thank you so much. You're welcome. But I hope you're feeling better today, and I hope you get a good, better night's rest tonight. I'm gonna feel better night. when it stops bleeding. Cause yeah, like, I know. It, this stuff needs to like close up, cause it's like hecka. Like I, if I put my finger out the back of my head right now, it'd be red. I think you just need to stop talking for the night, cause maybe that's just what it, it what's going be. on. It's so weird, like having my hair pulled back and talking to you guys now, cause like I never done that before. But, yeah, like, you hey, guys, I'm we're actually, showing you guys. Like he's showing you guys one of his biggest insecurities right now, and this is his biggest insecurity. And trust me, like this is gonna. Look Looks so good when it's grown in and I cannot wait to see the final result because like like it's just it's gonna fill in so well right now obviously it doesn't look amazing because it's not supposed to but like I appreciate all of the like lovey comments all the support that we're getting across TikTok, our YouTube Instagram everything you guys have been awesome also follow us on Instagram because I have been posting stories about this and if you want to see more Did you brush your teeth today no oh my god that is disgusting I'll brush my teeth right now 
But if you want to see more, follow us on Instagram. As you can tell, we're both really tired. And I'm going to try to get some better sleep tonight because last night I did not get that good of sleep. Yeah. But guys, we're going to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. We love you so much. And we, we will see you in the next video. But until, until then, then peace. Love, love you guys. guys.